You know how to be like made back music? Uh -huh. Made back music. Okay, so what's the one do? Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Happy birthday to you. Hey. Place is called Phuket Best Friend Co. We are here right now. They're giving the instructions on before we get on the boat. It's supposed to be three different boats. I hope we're not on a boat with a whole bunch of kids. Cause like, what? <laughs> like, what? like I'm just trying to be drunk today. Doesn't look like that's happening until later, so. Cause this is like a whole excursion thing. They have snorkeling. We're gonna go to a couple different islands. Um, if I can get a close up visual of the actual sign in the front, I'll try to get that in here. Cause it actually has all the excursions on it. But I don't, I definitely won't be snorkeling because I put on makeup today. Yeah, I put on highlighter and blush today. And I use that Sephora palette set. And I actually really like it. Like the highlighter and the blush together. The lady at Sephora that helped me out with this set. Like I really actually like it. Like it turned out pretty good. I didn't do any lashes today because I didn't want them falling off or anything. It's pretty much an overcast right now. But I hope once we get out at the, um, on the ocean it'll be more sunlight. But yeah, we getting... Is this day four? This is day four started. Uh, it's Julia's actual 30th birthday today. We turned up this morning, took shots. After we got dressed, y'all, we was getting dressed at like 5, 6 in the morning, like, and then was dancing and taking shots in the morning. Like, we was lit this morning, but yeah, we about to go ahead and get this started. I just want to come on and talk to y'all, start the video out, but I'll see y'all in a little bit. And the beach around the corners. So that beach is like powder, powder sand beach, you know, it's so beautiful. Just they don't allow you to swim now nah, because many years ago now nah, they wouldn't allow when they allow for people to swim, you know? Like thousand people in the dive in the same time, you know, going swim together. This is a wild well monkey, you know, like jungle monkey. Nah, they they're not friendly like you think now, nah, you know, they're aggressive now. Nah. They're not same people, uh, monkey with the people, you know, they still have it like a wild life, you know. So when they're angry, they're like a mafia, you know. <laughs> they will fight you, you know. And when they bite you, you know, they have slight of poison Ooh. that will make you sick, you know. What? Same like the jungle. <laughs> right, and then after that, we will come back. Huh? So time we come back about 4.30. Huh? Oh, I'm oh, sorry, 5 or 5.30, huh? Yeah, about, about that, okay. Alright, and uh, now we would like to tell you for what I've got in the boat, we have a boat for you. Now, uh, like for shopping. Now, uh, for the mask. I am very curious as to what boat we're getting on. I was trying to look at everybody's bands and stuff to see how big these boats are, but like, uh, it don't feel like a boat where you can. I don't know, I thought we were getting on. Like a yacht. But the original boat that we were supposed to be on they canceled for the day and we paid less for this one but i feel like i don't know these boats is not giving me what i thought it was going to be but the ones that got out here i don't really know i can't tell and the guy is still like giving instructions but he's talking about snorkeling i'm not snorkeling for this i'm not doing that today Okay. Yeah, I hope I get to get some good, like, sightseeing photos, because I'm really excited to see the lagoon. If you guys saw on the map I was showing you of, like, the activities you can do on this excursion. So, I'm hopeful. What is that noise, I'm hopeful that 
I get some good footage of the lagoon because I feel like that's going to be absolutely insane to this. So I can't wait to see that. I hope y'all can hear me. I'm trying my best to be as loud as I can, but it's hard over all this noise. This is my swimsuit for the day. I have this pink cover up and then a tiger on my bathing suit. And then this pink necklace. So yeah, full one piece. LaFree is looking at me like, girl, who are you talking to? <laughs> the fans, okay? Talking to the fans. I'm talking to the real seekers. The real, okay? Yeah, go ahead. The Say real, it. The real. She's talking to the real seekers, okay? You hear she got for her sexy voice. The real. That's exactly what she did. She sure did. You know how to be like the real. You know how to be like made back music? Made back music. Okay, so so what we gonna do? Maybe Go ahead, do it. Real secret. <laughs> the real secret. <laughs> I got both of these from Shein. Also, the necklace I had on has turned my whole chest pink. So that's cute. Not that's cute. I had to throw that away. You threw it out? Yeah. Let's go. Ooh, yummy. <laughs> yes. The buttery good. Yeah. This area only, but if you get lost, 
Just remember, PP Hospital. You see the brown color, the brown brown building in the corner. That's PP Hospital. Because 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 we also we can touch only in this this area. We're belonging, everything safety with the board. I was never recording. So we're at Fifi Island. Absolutely beautiful. We were over here. Yeah, we're down that way. But it's so gorgeous. We ate here, got some souvenirs. But yes, now I need to hurry up and get back on the boat before we get left.
Yeah. Last day vibes. Right, Mommy, I said two to three times. Last day vibes. <laughs> uh oh. Hey. Yeah. Oh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a fake turn up girl. Like, no, not right. a fake turn up girl. Like, this angry. Right. Right. It was terrible. She's all out. We all have this moment's ass. That's what we all have. Ass everywhere. Ass everywhere. Ass everywhere. Ass everywhere. I gotta go for <laughs> Okay, y'all, we're at Kamala Beach and we're about to get some souvenirs before we leave. Um, we were able to get the shuttle over from our villa. So we're just gonna go ahead and see what we can find. Cause I have a few more I wanna get. And then I might get some more things for myself, but I'm not sure yet. So I'm gonna see. What's up? Hey, I know, cause I need one for my dad. Yeah, you know what they have actually. Oh, that's pretty. And you like bowls, so yeah, hold it straight for me. Cool. Yeah, it's so pretty. Isn't it cool? Are you getting something for you or like somebody else? Yeah. Uh, you like? Yeah. <gasps> I did. Ouch! I did want a fan, but I kind of want it. I bought something yesterday. I found for myself. Did you want one? Oh, one that's custom. Yeah. That's cute. That's really cute. It is hot. Hey! Hey, girl! Oh, I just noticed this bag. Oh, it's a hat. Oh, that one? I know what is up with the, the label hats. I, Cause like the ones still had Chanel fake knockoff Chanel. And it was like what? Oh, my bun. Wow, yeah. I don't need sunglasses. <laughs> Look at these Spider-Man hats. Crying. Hey, come on, house. That's a cute coffee house. Good, how are you? So it's a bunch of shops over here, but... Oh! I don't think I'll put bug spray on my shoulder. The real song? Yeah. Ooh, it's junky. Ooh. Like, what, what is going on here? Like, Dior did not make that. This is so nice. Yeah, like something like this. Yeah. They got a little tuck tuck taxis too.
Look at that one. So that one. Wow, what does it smell like? It smells this amazing. amazing. This one smells really good. Oh wow, this smells good. It doesn't really it? Good. That smells good. I never heard of this brand. That's a big box. What size is that one? They don't have prices on them. Oh, that's how they get you. You know what that means? Excuse oh, is that me. Musk? How much is this? Sixty-nine dollars. Oh. Oh. Okay. Thank you. And Katara? Let me smell this. I think USD. Oh, USG? That's actually pretty good. And it smells amazing. Oh, the amber one. I didn't like that the way that smells. I like the way I'm gonna the, smell that these. one smells. What are these? It's only $69. This bottle is just so cute. Wait, I might have to cop for $69. I can cop too. Because it actually $69. smells really good. Oh, this smells good. Or is it just I think this smells good. Smell this. Dreamy. Oh my God. Oh, that smells really good. Oh, no, not right there. That right there. Smell this one, Ju. Mm. That smells good. Oh, again. she purchased it. Julia, smell this oh one. God, Sorry if you got my finger. Smell this one. I'm in love with this one. Oh, it's an oil? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, which one? Oh, is this a, is How much is it? Probably less. You have to ask, probably. That smells yeah, good. That smells so, let me tell y'all about this man right here, okay? He was so rude. And this is what I was talking about in one of my last vlogs about this man because, y'all, he was mad that he had the middle seat. So he made it a whole big thing. He was sitting up with his elbows in my back the whole ride. And mind you, these are not short flights. So this was us flying from Qatar back to JFK. And when I tell y'all, he was so difficult. He ended up by towards like the last four hours of the flight, he ended up complaining to the flight attendants that he didn't have no room because I was too big and da da da. da. And when I tell y'all, I literally was like you're so lucky we're on a plane right now because I could smooth, clean, knock you out. But I can't do that because I want to be able to fly. But, y'all, when I tell you, he pissed me off so bad. Like, I mean, nastiest attitude ever. If you were so mad about being in the middle seat, they gave us ample amount of chances to change our seats before the flights even happened. Like, they kept emailing us, kept giving us options. You could have easily gotten another seat or you could have upgraded you chose to keep the middle seat because you either didn't have no money to get a new seat or you just was being lazy. And he tried to even make the woman next to him on the other side of us move her seat because he just didn't want to be in between two women. And the fact that I was bigger than him, he tried to make it a whole thing. But y'all, it was so nasty because like when he was eating and snoring in my damn ear, I literally was like, I had to text my, text my family and go like, look, Y'all, this man on this plane just pissed me smooth off. I'm trying to really, like, really, really, really just compose myself. And he was just really making a whole big deal about the situation because he was trying to get them to upgrade his seat. But the flight was booked because the flight attendant, even in the beginning of the flight, told him, like, you need to sit down. Like, I don't know what you're doing, but you need to sit down. And it was just like, that was probably the worst flying experience from back from Qatar to um, JFK. I really didn't care for it. So it's really like, I don't know, like being overseas in the Middle East, I will say it was a little difficult because I feel like they're a little more prejudiced over there towards women of a larger size versus like me flying in the U.S. or flying to the Caribbean. I don't have these kind of problems really. So that's why it was kind of like a first time for me that was really irritating because I've never had somebody like make a big deal about my size or try to use that as an implication of they can't sit next to me. So that really bothered me towards the end of this trip. But other than that, like when we flew to when we flew to Thailand, like that day we flew in, it was perfectly fine. I ain't had no problems. It was this last flight back. And that man was just like <laughs> smooth pissing me off. But yeah, this is the end of this vlog. I had a great trip. Um, I would definitely recommend going to Thailand. 
and, you know, visiting Phuket or I've heard ba great things about Bangkok too. So if I definitely will go back, I will go back and see like Bangkok for a day or two. But I had the time of my life. This was a trip that I never thought in a million years I would ever go on. I This was not even in my mind, but I'm glad that Julia picked this for her 30th birthday destination because I would have never gone. Like I would have never really thought to go probably not until my 30s. So I'm glad that she did that. But she's our traveler friend. So whenever we go somewhere for her birthday, it's always a great trip. And I was just so grateful for the experience. But yeah, all right, y'all, I'm out. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, run it up for your girl. And remember, always come back for more because we're going to have more. Even though it's a little late, we're going to always have more. All right, I'll holler at y'all. Bye.